I want to take you on an adventure, a new adventure to an old favourite, Sandalford Wines, 20 minutes drive from Perth in one of Australia's oldest wine growing regions. We've brought you here numerous times and for good reason. We've sipped exquisite wines, meandered through the vines, inhaled deeply while learning from the winemakers, and we've eaten here many times, and now they've raised the bar. This wonderful piece of our state's history is both the same yet very different. The whole experience has been reimagined. It's time to explore new tastes, bid farewell to the culinary grind of our daily routines without the need for a holiday or a long weekend and embark on an Epicurean journey with a culinary maestro. Sandiford is home to the best restaurant in WA. And it's added to that title recently, it's also been awarded Best Contemporary Restaurant in Australia. And Alan Spagnolo is the genius responsible for creating the culinary memories, not just in this restaurant, but in every food-related moment at Sandiford. While he's prepping for lunch, let me show you around. It's the cleverest setup here, lots of people always, it's so popular. In fact, it's a Friday and four of the function and banquet rooms are set for weddings tonight and tomorrow, but somehow, somehow it always manages to seem like your event is the only thing happening. This room dates back to the late 90s. The Prenneville family acquired the business in the early 90s and they decided they wanted to create a world-class wine tourism facility here. And this was one of the first rooms that they designed and built. A room that was multi-purpose, could be used for weddings as it's been set for tonight. But one of the, the things that people love when they walk into the room is very much that you're distinctly in a winery. It's got a beautiful feel, it's got a beautiful ambience about it. The walls are expanding though, aren't they? The walls are expanding and, and, and that is a reflection of the change in our business and the growth in wine tourism to the Swan Valley. And, and today, more than 200,000 guests visit Sounderford every year and we've taken a long-term view to expand our facilities. We've uh, increased the size of our restaurant capacity, we've added on additional function space, we've expanded our event program, we've done so many things to cater for that increased demand from not only Western Australians but from people interstate and all over the world. We were always uh, uh, an award-winning facility, but um, Alan Spagnolo, as the executive chef, joined us when we reopened post-COVID. He is a truly world-class chef and who has talents that transcend um, not only a la carte operations, but the entirety of our, our functions and banquet operation here, which is another 100,000 people or so. So he's a fabulous person. He's had a great training. He's a Western Australian. Um, his Italian heritage um, has influenced the style of cuisine here and the guests love him. And we hope that, you know, he, he continues to be part of the Sanford success story, like all of our team here who are long-term team members. I was very excited to come here and I kind of pushed for it and I, uh, I rang a few people to kind of get an interview with Grant, actually. It's not exactly a small job that you've undertaken. Did you realise when you came on board how big it was going to be? Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> I, yeah, I love being busy, I love doing things on a scale, I suppose. It goes all the way back to my childhood, I suppose. Being, having an Italian heritage, growing up around food and large tables of people eating and talking loudly to each other and, and growing our own produce, um, going to the farm, things like this. Why do you think people continue to come back here? I think the consistency. Honestly, we are very consistent in what we do, very proud of what we do. And I think we try and over deliver on the plate when people come here. Do you think that this kitchen really is the heart of Sandiford? I think so. And I think because it's so open and it's a big part of the restaurant, you're, you're in touch with the clientele, but the chefs are always on the floor talking to the customers. I think it's good. Yeah, I think definitely. The kitchen is open seven days a week. And what strikes me about the staff, the team that Alan and Grant have established, is how happy they are given the pressure that everyone is under, not just from guests, but from themselves to create wonderful food and memories. And that energy flows through this place. And I'm grateful to have snuck in some time with both Grant and Alan. Right, enough talking. Time to sample the latest menu. 42 gold plate awards. They deserve every single one of them and they will deserve every single one that they'll win in the future with Alan's menus. They are absolutely fantastic. 
I was reading some reviews on the way out here doing some preparation and they were all talking about this fantastic new menu and saying it was indescribable. I would have to say I agree with them totally. You are going to have to come out here and experience Sanderford reimagined for yourself. Cheers.